Your hoodie looks like morning breakfast time. My hoodie looks like Dave Kemp from Nush. <laughs> Dave Kemp from Nush is probably the smiliest, nicest, brightest guy I know. I would agree, but I'm glad you mentioned Nush because today we're gonna review a brand new product from Nush. It's Pancake Mix. Hey, what's up family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, Two Crazy, Crazy Ketos. Ketos. And if you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos, we do product reviews, we talk about various keto topics, and then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us in different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. And that's where you're gonna find all of our different recipes. Now we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon, and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. I'm so excited about this one. Noosh. First of all, we're not into pancakes usually on keto. We weren't into pancakes pre-keto, but I'm really excited about this one because of the ingredients. Now, if you don't know what Noosh is, they make some of the most delicious cakes and cookies ever and they are super clean ingredients crazy clean ingredients i absolutely love the banana muffin my favorite like in the cakes is the carrot cake but just to give you an idea i just i mean i know this is about this but we have these cakes and it's hard for us to keep them in the house because like i hide them rachel finds them There's, rachel hides them i find them they're so fresh baked tasting yeah Ingredients in these cakes, flax, organic flax water, egg yolk, erythritol, coconut oil, glycerin, sunflower lecithin, blueberries, natural flavors, sea salt, sodium bicarbonate, monk fruit extract, and stevia. Like super clean ingredients. That's the it. cookies are the same way. And they're not intended to be on a shelf for 25 years. No, not they're that delicious. They're, not that they're going to last on a shelf for 25 years because I'm going to find them and eat them. But the company is all about improving their product too. And I mean, we met Dave Kemp last year at KetoCon. I have to tell you, he was the most welcoming person to this community I've ever met. We sat down, we talked to him, he was telling us how like, they are constantly listening to people and saying like, you know, hey, we don't like this and they're changing their formulations. Cause we were honest, we said, hey, first time I tried your cakes, did not like them. He's like, try the new formulation. Yeah, we were amazed and just such a nice guy. So is Bobby, who yeah. also works with Nish. Just, she's an incredible lady and we, we're so glad to meet them. I think he would hug a velociraptor. Yeah, he's always got a smile on his face. He would hug a velociraptor. Were you ready to get into the pancakes? Yes. So I'm really excited about this because like I said, we're not usually into pancakes because I don't want to deal with all the almond flours and stuff like that. But I'm into clean ingredients. And, we're, and I haven't even looked at the ingredients in this, but I know Nush. So this is a Nush pancake mix made with flaxseed. It says right here on keto. It's got my smiley face. It does say two net carbs, diabetic friendly, paleo, and gluten free. Are you ready? Yes, I am. I've got some pancakes right here. Yum. Now. It looks like a pancake. There are 25 servings in this container. I worked really hard to measure this out. Properly. This is one serving. One pancake. So this is, I think that's a decent size pancake. Some that of these is. ones you see them, they're like that big. Silver right? dollar. So this is, so before I don't touch butter on everything, before you have to have a little piece oh, without. without any butter. I got some on the you're side. You're cheating. Like get rid of that butter on your fork. There you go. All right. You gotta, you gotta give this the true test, right? Yeah. You gotta test it without butter with butter and with butter and syrup and then with butter and syrup yes we gotta dink it though you gotta dink it dink, dink. that's a pancake that is a pancake so as i was cooking this it's beyond a pancake it's like it's like a belgian waffle pancake as i was cooking it i smelled like cake batter it smelled wow. like cake batter okay you gotta try it with the butter now okay it is not an almond flour no, bomb. Uh, no grit. There's no grit. No grit. Okay, that made it better. I don't even need syrup. I don't either. There's sweetness to this. There is a sweetness. I don't know what the ingredients are, but there is some sweetness. But let's do it right. Let's do it right. Let's do it right. Not a lot. Just, just a little. Just a little. 
Hit me. Hit you? Hit me. I'm not allowed to hit you. Well, I mean like a dealer. Okay. I feel like you have more pancake than me. That's not fair. I need some pancake from you because like, I'm gonna eat a bunch of this. This is really good. Oh yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. No, this is pancakes. Somebody's trying to visit us, but don't say her name. Don't say her name because she's right there and she would really love some pancakes. I'm eating this whole thing. I'm sorry. Mm, me too. But you want to do five things? Five things. You're interrupting my breakfast <laughs> for dinner. If you're new to our channel, we review all products based on five things. We're going to talk about the ingredients. Does it keto based on an nutrition label? How does it taste? How much does it cost? And finally, would we recommend this? Number one. Number one is the ingredients. Let me find them on here. It is a very short list. Flaxseed, eggs, coconut flour, erythritol, natural flavors, organic natural flavors, sodium bicarbonate, which is basically baking powder, salt, and monk fruit extract. So it's got coconut flour, but I honest to goodness do not taste coconut. Do you taste I'm, coconut? I don't taste coconut. And the mm. thing with the flaxseed is sometimes that can be gritty. There's no grit to this. No grit. And the third ingredient is, or fourth ingredient, is erythritol. There is no cooling effect whatsoever. But that must be the sweetness that you were talking That's about. The, and there's monk fruit in there. I'm gonna eat this Will you go on to the nutrition. Head right to, oh, so let's talk about how I made this. So before we even get into number two, two pancakes right. is a quarter of a cup of the mix, mm -hmm. a quarter of a cup of, of water, and one tablespoon of oil. I used avocado oil. I'm sure right. you can use coconut oil. You could probably get away with using butter. I used avocado oil, so that's how I did it. So they give you two different things, one on just the pancake mix, one on the pancake mix with the oil. Let's just go right into that one. Let's let's. That's how you're gonna eat it. Nobody's gonna eat just the mix. But I love that they break that out so that you you get all of the information. Yep. So the pancake mix with oil is gonna be one pancake is 100 calories, eight grams of fat, three grams of protein, five total carbohydrates, uh, two dietary fiber, and one sugar alcohol. So you're looking at what two net carbs per, per pancake. pancake. And you saw the pancake. And I will say too, you didn't mention this, but they've got right on here, they're using Redmond as their salt. That's so awesome. Yeah. Number three, how do they taste? Well, I don't know. I ate mine and some of Rachel's. <laughs> they're really good. It is, I will say this, and it's not just because we like Dave and we like Bobby and we like Nush. It is rare when we do a product review that we finish our plate. Yeah. That I've, is kind of rare. So far. This is the best keto pancake I have tasted. It is absolutely the best keto pancake I've tasted. There is no weird grittiness. There is no weird aftertaste. I could eat it on its own because it does feel very rich, but I like it with butter. You can use the syrup. It was awesome with the you syrup. You don't need it. But you really don't, you don't need, need it. it. Put a little bit of butter on top of that. I'm telling you, you don't need the syrup. And I never would eat pancakes without syrup. But there is a nice sweetness. It's almost like a cake batter. It really is almost like a cake batter. Yeah. It Honestly, a lot of times we do these reviews, we try these, and then we hand this stuff to the kids. They're not getting They're not this. touching this. Okay. Number four, how much do they cost? All right, here we go. Okay, so we actually have my phone here because it's a brand new product. There's a few different ways we can buy this. So let's start off individually. You can buy just one bag. It's $12.99. Okay, so that's like 50 cents a pancake. Seems a little expensive, but 50 cents a pancake. They also have on their website a three pack, which I think is an awesome deal. It's $35 and you get three bags of these. That's nice. I mean, but they also have some other cool things too. They have a pancake mix and cookie bundle. So you can get the pancake mix and some of these cookies and that's $40.75. And then they also have a pancake and a cake mix bundle mm. or cake bundle. And then they even have a pancake, a cookie, and a cake bundle. So there are lots of different options to get. That would be nice for like the holidays. You're just done. You've got like sweets, you've got breakfast. Everything is done for families to come in and visit. Yeah. Honestly, I think the way to go is the three bags of that. You save a dollar a bag. And here's the thing. 
we don't make any money off of Nush. We just really like the people. We like good food. We like the food. They taste good. We like the ingredients. We like the ingredients. And so we don't make any money off of it. But I mean, Bobby and, you know, Dave, they're the kind of people that every time we want to do a giveaway or like when we had the 12 days of keto Christmas last year and we said, hey, we need to do something. They're like, absolutely. What do you want? Whatever you want. That's how they are. I mean, when KetoCon got smiling. canceled this year, Dave Kemp organized for all of the vendors to send goodie boxes out to like all of the different people who would tickets for keto Con. seriously the nicest guy ever that we love them so because of that whenever they have a product we want to review it we don't make any money but what we did ask them for is a coupon code right so that anybody who does want to get this and again we don't make any money if you use the coupon code but for the next 48 hours if you use the coupon code two crazy ketos you get 15 percent off on buying it so now That's you're really deal. knocking it down that knocks a bag down to less than ten dollars a bag what do you think? I think that's stinking awesome for a delicious pancake. Number five, would we recommend these? I cannot recommend this highly enough. This is what we should be eating on the weekends, cup of coffee, pancakes, eggs, bacon. It's just perfect and great for kids. This is what you should be giving to your kids. Now, does this cost more money than buying like the Hungry Jack pancake mix in the grocery store? Of course it does. But it doesn't have garbage in it. But look, there is not many people, the strictest of strict keto people can argue with these ingredients. Flaxseed, eggs, coconut flour, erythritol, natural flavors. Maybe somebody wants to argue with natural flavors, but it's organic natural flavors. That goes a long way. Salt and monk fruit extract. You can't argue with those ingredients. It's They're clean. The nutrition. They're the nutrition. How cute are they? <laughs> I can't recommend these hot more. I mean, they're just awesome tasting. I don't think it, t it costs a lot of money for what you're getting. No, and it's very fresh tasting and it cooks up just like the pancakes that you're used to. It's not like yeah. you have to cook it in a weird thing. I would throw this right in my dash. Yeah. Make a couple silver dollar ones. I'll tell you what, I know how much you like. You can have this. I'll have this. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's going to be our video for today. Let us know if you've ever tried any of the Nush products. Uh, let us know down in the comments. Like, what is your favorite flavor Nush? Do you like the cookies? Do you like the cakes? Have you even tried the pancake mix yet? Also, let us know if you use that coupon code down below. I'm curious what everybody thinks of it. Yeah. Now, if you like seeing videos like this and you want to see some other product reviews, we have an entire playlist, which you're going to find right down there. Also, make sure you take a look at our most recent video, which you're going to find right over here. But whether you head this way or you head this way, don't forget to head this way. Subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell icon. That way, every single time I eat pancakes and don't share them with Joe, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time. Bye. bye.